Yo, so how's it going guys? Welcome back to another GTA 5 video. So as I'm sure you guys were aware, a couple days ago Rockstar Games released a brand new GTA Online San Andreas Mercenaries DLC, which of course did include a bunch of expensive content from the Avenger upgrades, new vehicles, and even a bunch of new clothing. So with all of this content, I know a bunch of you guys are going to be in need of some serious money very, very quickly. Not only can these money maker methods be done 100% solo, but they're also extremely easy so I guarantee all of you guys could jump online straight away and make millions of dollars without any stress so as always if you guys do go on to enjoy the video and you do want to see me cover more money guides in the future all I ask is you do return the favor by dropping a like down below and if you guys are new around here hit that subscribe button and turn notifications on as I do post daily GTA 5 videos with that being said let's get into the video okay so coming in for the very first money making method and that's by completing in this week's brand new time trial it is known as up chiliad however the best part is it will earn you guys a very nice 100k and only takes one minute to complete now you guys that have seen my previous time trial tutorials you'll know that i hate doing these time trials at night time as they make them more difficult but just to prove that this time trial is so easy i complete it during the daytime and the nighttime. so as i mentioned earlier this week's time trial is located over near mount chiliad the first thing i would do is head over to the time trial start it as I do on screen then you can see the finish line as soon as the finish line starts up you want to mark it down so you got a little waypoint so just so you know where you're going when you relaunch it then from here you want to hold Y so it restarts the race so from here you're able to start the race fresh with a waypoint just so you got a little mark of where you guys know where you're going so you want to line your bike up to the left side of your starting position pop a wheelie as soon as you press right on the d-pad to get that little extra boost of speed you want to zing past this little white tree and then go up this little hill right here now from here you can see Consistently pop wheelies and keep going up the hill until you look for these little trees keep popping wheelies up this mountain until you see another set of trees here on the left you want to basically take a cut right next to this rock next to this tree now from here you just want to pop wheelies as much as you can straight to the top of this hill and you guys should notice the texture of the hill will start to change from green grass more to like a sandy like gray color however keep popping wheelies there's two options you've got here you can try and hold a wheelie as long as you want or keep popping quick wheelies back to back like I'm doing go up this little rock and you should should land straight on this dirt path or nearabouts on it now from here you just want to follow this dirt path you can hold down a or pop a few more little wheelies like i'm doing if you're feeling confident with yourself i nearly fell off there you saw you do have potential like i said to mess up by a few seconds and still complete this time trial i actually messed up three different times and still completed it within one minute 10 seconds which i will show you guys in just a second however keep following this little dirt path around the corner now as soon as you guys see that sign you want to take an immediate left and wheelie up this hill bang now of course if you guys are ps5 or xbox series players then we also get an extra time trial added into the game known as the hsw time trial which will be earning you guys a very nice 250k in only 1 minute 20 seconds. Now this week's HSW time trial is known as East Vinewood and like I said only has a part time of 1 minute 20 seconds. Now of course the catch with the HSW time trials is that you do have to use a HSW vehicle. As you guys can clearly see on screen my preference is to use the Hakuchu drag with the HSW upgrade as this is hands down by far the fastest motorbike in the game and whilst there is a ton of fast hsw cars you can use for this time trial the reason i also prefer using the bike is because you guys can just swerve in and out of traffic very very easily as you guys can see me doing on screen now just to prove that i guarantee all of you guys could beat this time trial using this motorbike i go ahead and fall off my motorbike during the time trial as you guys can see on screen i'm able to get back on my motorbike and still beat the part time so literally all you guys have to do is go ahead take your time on the corners don't try and rush this time trial as like i said this motorbike is way too quick for this time trial so as long as you guys just don't make any mistakes and set a waypoint the same way i said for the previous time trial i guarantee all of you guys can come on straight away and earn some fast money however coming in for the third best money making method all of you guys should be making the most of and of course that is the double money and double rp rockstar games are currently offering on the air quota adversary mode now if you guys are looking to make the most amount of money and rp from grinding this double money method what you guys simply have to do is just make sure the time limit runs through the 10 minutes 
as by letting the full 10 minutes run through, you guys will be earning a very nice $40,000 along with 5,000 RP. However, you guys can increase this, so you might be aware that you can only play two rounds. So you're probably thinking I could only earn 80K and maybe 10K RP. Whereas you can actually earn more than this by winning the rounds back to back. It's going to increase your final payout by giving you guys a winner's round bonus. So you're going to be earning more around 130k and closer to 15k RP if you guys, like I said, are able to win both rounds one after the other. And of course, another great method is if you guys are busy and you just want to make some money in the background, you can start up one of these adversary modes, invite a bunch of random players in and just go afk and you guys will be earning a ton of money and rp while basically doing nothing on the game as like i said it is paying out double money and double rp so by collecting a nice 130k and 15k rp per game that really will stack up quickly if like i said you guys do want to go for the afk method however coming in for the next money making method and that is by grinding out the new lsa operations these missions can be launched in free roam and have to be launched from the back of your avenger on the brand new operations terminal now the payouts will vary from 48k to 64 however you guys do have the potential to earn a 15k bonus on these missions so they are pretty fun to do and like i said considering they are new there is tons of players grinding them out so it's a great way to just grind out some money in free roam while checking out some of the new missions so for a quick example i went ahead and done this one known as surgical strike and in this mission all i had to do was locate a smuggler basically hack his phone but once you guys hack his phone all you have to do is go ahead and make your way over to the Meriwether base now there is two ways you guys can go about completing this part of the mission you can go to stealth way and collect a Meriwether outfit and just walk in there as i do on screen or you can do with one of my teammates done who was unaware i had a Meriwether outfit and just go in guns blazing however as i mentioned earlier all of these missions will come with a side bonus to earn some extra money in this mission all i had to do was go ahead and collect this artifact which was located over here however once you guys have done that all you guys have got to do is mark these shipments with your flares i see once again all of my teammates confused on where their flares won this is just your flare gun as you guys can see i had no ammo this time but simply just reload the ammo shoot it with your flare gun and once you guys make your way away from the mission you can now call in the airstrike once the airstrike is called in all you guys have to do is retrieve the hive menacer and deliver it back to your lsa lockup and that is the mission completed so very easy and very straightforward missions and once again if you guys are looking for active players to grind these out with do be sure to join my discord server which i will leave linked as a pinned comment underneath this video however coming in for the next best money making method that all of you guys should be making the most of and i'm going to give you guys a heads up on how you can make this a walk in the park in just a second but of course that is the famous kyle perico heist as i'm sure the majority of you guys are aware the max payout for the kyle perico heist of course is a whooping 4.1 million dollars however this is the maximum you guys can earn when you have a group of four players and that is what i want to let you guys know about if you are wanting to grind out the kyle perico heist do be sure to go ahead and join my discord server which i will leave linked as a pinned comment underneath this video i've just created a new channel today on the discord server specifically for grinding money out with kyle perico so you guys can find players easily so you can come online straight away and like i said make millions every single hour by grinding out this heist as you guys can see on screen once you guys go ahead and join the discord server make sure you click on the left click on kyle perico an option will drop down with all of the different platforms simply select whatever platform you guys play on and then you should be able to find a player easily that's on the same platform as you guys and feel free to invite some of your friends into the discord server as i will be adding a bunch of new channels and features into the discord server including a channel where you guys can share your outfits paint jobs glitches so do be sure to join the discord server and i also want some feedback from you guys as to what you'd like to see me incorporate in the discord server however that is going to do it for me guys by far the best ways to make money in gta 5 online as of right now as always if you guys have enjoyed this video and you would like to see me cover more videos on how to make money in gta 5 online in the future all i ask is you do return the favor by dropping a like down below and if you guys are new around here feel free to subscribe and turn on 
notifications on as I do post daily GTA 5 videos. Thanks a lot for watching, guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Peace!